Hey everyone, what's going on? This is Mr. Riley from Mr. Riley's World. And do you remember where you were four years ago? Well, I remember where I was four years ago. Uh, would you like to know where I was? Sure, I'll definitely tell you. However, you have to just stick around and I'll let you know where I was four years ago. Hey everyone, welcome, welcome back. I am Mr. Riley from Mr. Riley's World and I am participating in VEDA. That's right, VEDA stands for Video or Vlog Every Day in April. And so this is my day five video. Did you know that playing college football is a dream of thousands of athletes across the country? But many families are unsure about how to get recruited for football, in fact, the NCAA reports that only about 7% of high school football players will compete at the college level and approximately 3% will play Division I football. And not all football players will receive athletic scholarships. This is not a brag post. This is just a post of gratitude and just how grateful that I am for my boys who worked hard on the field and off the field to receive a division one scholarship. So a few moments ago, I teased about knowing where I was four years ago. In fact, I know where I was. I was on an unofficial junior day college visit with my oldest son, Sir Riley. That's right, we were visiting the University of California, which we call Cal. And so parents, in this video, I just wanna describe three ways that you will know your son is being recruited by a college or university. And so one of the ways that you'll know if your son is being recruited by a college or university is if they receive some kind of invitation to attend an unofficial or to take an unofficial visit. That's right, pre-COVID, uh, colleges and universities used to send out an invitation to attend a junior day. And so a junior day was just inviting uh, the juniors going into their senior season of football. Uh, they just wanted to invite them to maybe check out the college. Uh, they're kind of interested in your son. And so that is a good way for them to uh, take measurements, uh, weight, height, um, reach, and then also for them uh, to, to tour the campus, to see what the campus is all about, maybe meet with some of the players, uh, share uh, some of the information can be shared by some of the coaches. And so your son is checking them out. And of course, they're definitely checking your son out. And so we went to Cal Berkeley um, and we were invited by the offensive line staff. Uh, Steve Greatwood, I believe, was the name of the coach over there at Cal Berkeley. And so we had a wonderful time. We toured the facility, uh, Memorial Stadium, I believe it was called. We had lunch and we had um, some coaches talk to some of the parents and they shared information about Cal and what it means to be a football player at Cal. And then the second way that you'll know or another way that you'll know that you're being recruited by a college or university is if your son starts to receive all these correspondences either to home or to their um, high school. Man, we received tons of uh, cards, uh, personally written cards by the different coaches saying, hey, uh, good luck on your upcoming season. Uh, work hard uh, this summer. Uh, finish strong in your junior year as it relates to being in the classroom. Grades do matter. And so they were sending out personal cards. And so that's another way that you will know, parent, if your son is being recruited by a college or university. And another way you will know that your son is being recruited by a college or university simply if their high school coach is um, has been contacted by that particular college and so in my case uh, these colleges reached out to the uh, high school coach and what he did uh, he was able to tell uh, my sons hey so and so is looking at you uh, and that and, and sometimes they even put them on the phone call and they would have conversations from these different colleges. And so he had an opportunity to talk to coaches from, of course, Cal, uh, from Washington State, uh, from Navy, from Colorado State, from Idaho. I mean, he was recruited by, I think, um, eight or nine different colleges. And so, yeah, sometimes these college coaches will contact the high school coach and they'll have a conversation. And so sometimes right there, as the conversation is taking place, uh, the college coach might offer uh, 
might offer a scholarship to the high school recruit. And so uh, those are just three simple ways that you will know if your son is being recruited by a particular college or university. And so, um, yeah, I just kind of wanted to show you, highlight my son uh, four years ago. I know exactly where it was. He was being recruited by Cal. He didn't attend there because when he wanted to commit to go there and play football, all the slots were already taken. And so he opted to go, of course, to Washington State University. Go Cougs. So there you have it. Four years ago, hanging out at Cal Berkeley with my son on his junior day. Yes, the coaching staff invited him to come out, check out the campus. They were checking him out. He was checking them out. And so it was a good good trip to have. Um, even had an opportunity to meet one of the uh, young people that I uh, I know his, his family uh, really, really well. So it was good to kind of hang out and see Ray um, as he was one of the seniors on that particular Cal Berkeley team. And so there you have it. Um, as always, thank you for watching. And do me a favor, please, please, please like, comment, and subscribe. So that way you'll be notified anytime I drop a brand new video. In fact, watch this video right here. I believe this is a video when I was teaching my son how to drive uh, a couple of months ago. So enjoy it. And until the next video, please be safe.